In today's video, we're talking about HSN, not QVC. In other videos, I've talked about how I love QVC and I used to watch it all the time, but my sister prefers HSN. And one of her favorite presenters and brands is DG2's Diane Gilman. So in today's video, we're gonna talk about Diane Gilman and where she's been. Why is she no longer on HSN? Stick around for today's video. If you're new to this channel, welcome. I hope you will like and subscribe. This channel does videos about different topics, and I hope it's things that you'll enjoy and encourage you. Subscribing to a YouTube channel is free. Hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when the next video is published. Now to today's video. HSN, or the Home Shopping Network, was founded in 1982. It's based in Florida, I think the Gateway area of St. Petersburg. I believe it is owned by the same parent company that owns QVC. HSN does have a lot of leading brands. It also has some celebrity presenters. One of my sister's favorite presenters on HSN is Diane Gelman. Well, I've done some recent videos about QVC and some of their brands. One of the brands I love on QVC was created by Jean Bice. Now, Jean Bice passed away in 2011, but if you haven't seen that video and you like Quacker Factory and Jean Bice, I hope you will check out that video. I will try to remember and put the link to the video about Jean Bice and Quacker Factory in the description of this video. So you can click that link and watch the video. Like Jean Bice, Diane Gilman is a fashion designer that started this clothing line when she was over 40. Diane Gelman is an American clothing designer. She's been on HSN for over 20 years. She's known as the Jean Queen. She began specializing in jeans after she noticed that the denim industry was not catering to the baby boomers like herself. Since then, she's expanded the line. Now she offers tops and separates. I saw an interview with Diane Gelman recently, and she talked about when she was young, she loved fashion, especially denim. And she actually dressed some rock stars. I think she said Jimi Hendrix, Janis Joplin, Deep Purple, and even Jefferson Airplane. But as she became a middle-aged woman, she looked around and there weren't a lot of options in really good-looking denim jeans that would fit her body type. Diane explained in this interview that she found a manufacturer in New York that would manufacture her jeans. Now, she was already doing television sales. I think she said she was selling washable silk. So she already had that connection, but she brought this new line of denim that she had developed for her own body type to HSN. I believe she said in that interview that she was given a spot at 5 a.m. on a Sunday morning in February. She said it was a cold, yucky morning. <laughs> she was given this 5 a.m. spot, and it must have been around 1994. I'm just doing the math in my head, but she, she didn't say it was 1994, but it must have been around 94. But she went on that 5 a.m. spot, and she sold 5,000 jeans. Well, I think HSN realized they had something good with this jean that was made for middle-aged women. Well, Diane Gelman has become one of the top-selling designers on HSN. And even if you don't buy her jeans, you might like watching her presentation. It is great for women of that generation to see someone of their generation on television selling clothes with such enthusiasm. And they are kind of cute clothes. You really have to have her body shape to like the jeans, in my opinion. Um, she says she makes them for women with slim legs and a large tummy, and it seems like she does cater the jeans to that. I saw recently on HSN that she has two kinds of denim at this point. I think she has something called super stretch, and then she still has some of the classic denim that she started with. In November of 2022, 
HSN had a Facebook post where they announced that Diane Gelman would no longer be presenting on air for DG2. Diane was retiring from that position. HSN is still selling DG2, but they have a new on-air presenter. It's a man. His name is Sam. Let me know if you've seen the presentations where Sam is now selling the jeans. And let me know, what do you think? How do you think Sam's doing? Well, Diane Gelman is definitely a successful woman. She has made her way in fashion. Now, at age 77 or 78, I'm not sure of her exact age, she is not finished. Even though she's not presenting on HSN, she's written a new book, and I hope you'll check it out. The new book is titled Too Young to Be Old, How to Stay Vibrant, Visible, and Forever in Blue Jeans. Diane has had her health challenges over the years. In 2017, I think she said in an interview I saw it was Christmas Eve when she got a sonogram and found out she had breast cancer. Well, she was treating her breast cancer from 2017 to 2019, but at this point, I think she's doing very well and seems to be cancer-free. About three months ago, Diane started a YouTube channel and a podcast. If you're like Diane Gelman, check out her YouTube channel and podcast where she talks about aging. You can also keep up with Diane Gelman by checking out her Facebook page. She also has Instagram. I hope you've enjoyed today's video and learning a little bit about Diane Gelman. Comment and let me know, do you like Diane Gilman's jeans, the DG2s? And do you like HSN better or QVC? As I've admitted, for some reason, I liked QVC better. But I'm not watching as much of QVC as I've said in many videos. If I watch it too much, I buy too much. So let me encourage you today, enjoy your money, buy what you want to. But if you think you're overspending because you're watching those channels too often, turn them off and start doing something else. Well, thanks a lot, y'all. Until next time, bye.